What's going on everybody? Let's talk some NFL MVP odds and it's probably going to be a quarterback. The last time a non-quarterback won the award was in 2012 when, when Adrian Peterson rushed for 2,097 yards, nine from Eric Dickerson's 1984 record. Now, last year, Derrick Henry rushed for 2,027 yards, uh, had 17 rushing touchdowns and did not get one vote okay for mvp so if he breaks dickerson's record will he have a shot maybe he's at plus five thousand to to win the award he's the only non quarterback that i would maybe have a look at like you look at receivers the receivers never won the award so i know adams hill kelsey diggs hopkins they're all at plus fifteen thousand. they could probably be at plus one million they still wouldn't win it okay so let's look at some quarterbacks okay patrick mahomes at plus 400 he's the favorite followed by josh allen at plus 850 matthew stafford is at plus 1000 and then aaron Rodgers at plus 1400 now rogers won the award last year but i kind of think voters could warm up to him you know with everything that's going on uh him against the world him against the packers uh front office i, I kind of think the winner here in the in, in the public view is aaron Rodgers. so if he produces another great season at plus 1400 i can totally see him winning the award justin herbert and kyler murray are both at plus 1800 i like them both herbert dan marino won the award in the second year back in 1984 that's not exactly compared justin herbert to dan Brady now but with with the new additions there on the offensive line everything he's got at the receiver position man i can see herbert throwing for 40 touchdowns okay and kyler murray if he would have stayed healthy he might have rushed for a thousand yards last year we saw what happened a couple years back when lamar jackson had a phenomenal year running the ball over 1200 rushing yards he won the mvp and kyler murray throws the ball better than him. So can you see Kyler Murray rushing for 1,000 and throwing for 35? I certainly can. Deshaun Watson, this is an interesting one because he's at plus 5,000. There's too much off-field baggage, obviously. Not too many people are going to want to vote for him. But if he gets traded from Houston, says all the right things, has a phenomenal season. I mean, the guy led the league in yards last year. At plus 5,000, it would seem like an interesting play to me. Just seems like there's some interesting value. But my pick for MVP this year is Josh Allen at plus 850 of the Buffalo Bills. He got so much better from year two to year, to year three, and I think he's going to make yet another jump. We shall see what happens. And for everything regarding the world of betting, you can go to oddshark.com. Mm -hmm.